Four tubes in play. 486 pushing their partner back across the line. Not the best way to start out a match. 1228 scoring an Uber tube and autonomous. Here comes driver control. Vulcan making quick work of this field. Back to their human player, grabbing a red triangle, heading back to their home zone. Storm Robotics plopping a white ring onto the top of the rack. Vulcan taking in with their red triangle. Positronic Panthers putting up a blue square. Here comes Spike with the white circle. Vulcan heading back, this time white ring from their human player. GRT trying to negotiate the rack, put a white circle into the middle row. Storm coming over with the red triangle. Vulcan can't quite get the ring to fall, we're down to a minute left. Storm putting up a white circle. Positronic Panthers losing their grip on the red triangle. They're looking to score. With 40 seconds left. Blue Alliance almost has the entire top row filled. Positronic Panthers just gave themselves a logo. 26 seconds left. Positronic Panthers Blue square, aiming for the middle of the rack. Team Storm getting ready to deploy. So are the Panthers at Spike. 10 second mark, go Minibots, go! Looks like it's all Red Alliance. Spike, Panthers! House, even though the Red Alliance technically won the match, Thanks to the red card, they in fact lost the match and therefore are eliminated from the elimination bracket. So the final result of the disqual after disqualification, Blue Alliance wins and advances to the semifinals.